Okay, hi, second grade readers. I know you are hungry for reading material. Some of you are reading all the books that I send home from our classroom. You're reading in Epic, I know, because, um, because our class has read in just two months, we've read over 1,200 books, they tell me. Um, so you're reading in Epic. I know some of you are reserving books from the public library and doing pickup there, curbside pickup there. I know you're reserving books from our school library and having Mrs. Womer um, find them and then doing pickup there with our, our packet pickup. So way to go. I found another way you can get um, access to books and I want to show you. It's pretty easy once you know how to do it. So I'm going to share my screen in um, in Schoology, when you're in Schoology, under our graphics, our exploration graphics here, we've talked about how if you go down here, the red box is Wonders, right? This little red box says McGraw Hill, and that's the company that does our Wonders, right? So you've done that and you've tried clicking on Wonders, most of you. Um, below that, there is one that says Sora, and it looks like a little teeny tiny space shuttle type thing. If you click on that, it opens up a new page. And the first time, oh, it's like a little rocket guy or something. Hmm. The first time you do it, you have a couple of steps. And then once you've done it once, you don't have to do these steps anymore. So hang tight while you do the steps the first time. Um, it's not that hard. It says, my school is Olympia School District. Yes, you just click on that, okay? You click on the green, and then it says select your school, but really you're not really selecting your school. You're either saying your staff or students. Your students, right? So you would click on students. I have to click on staff. It doesn't let me click on students. You click on students, and then you just click that button again, green. Oh, and it might ask you, are you really Elizabeth Wilson? It won't ask you, are you really Elizabeth Wilson? It will ask you, are you uh, really Connor Thomas? Are you really? Anyway, it'll ask, ask you your name, right? And you click on your name. Okay, and then it has all of these cool books that you can check out. It's a different, it's related to the Timberland Public Library, but it's a different set of books. And the books that they're showing me, some of them are more for adults because they know I'm a staff member. But for you, it'll be all kid books. And you can check them out. You can explore, you can put them on your bookshelf, just like you do if, if you use OverDrive or if you use Libby with your library card ever. Um, you can search for for different things like I could check out Diary of a Wimpy Kid right now and I have noticed that some books that are there are big wait lists on at the public library if you look here you can get them right away so it's a really cool um, way to find some good books okay these are all I just searched for comic and graphic books so graphic novels and comic books right and these are all available for me right now Really good one, and they have audiobooks. Let's see which one of these is the audiobook. Oh, okay. Um, you can search by audiobook if you prefer to do an audiobook. Let's see down here. You can just spend time look and look and look. You can look at new books, new audiobook editions. Oh, it looks like they have some Spanish books. Most popular, your next great read. Anyway, super easy to check out new books that way. It's Sora. So you'll have Epic that's easy to access. You'll have Sora that's easy to access. You can always find some new books, new good books. Okay. So check them out. See if there's anything good that you would like to try. Okay. Bye.